you, Mr. Scandal. <laughs> Good night. Good night, Mr. Foresight. And I hope that Mars and Venus will be in conjunction while your wife and I are together. Well, and what use do you hope to make of this project? You don't think you ever like to succeed in your design upon me? Yes, Faith, I do. I have a better opinion, both of you and myself, than to despair. Did you ever hear such a toad? Harky devil, do you think any woman honest? Yes, several. Very honest. They'll cheat a little at cards sometimes, but that's nothing. Shaw, but virtuous. <clears throat> yes, I believe some women are virtuous too. But tis I believe that some men are valiant through fear. For why should a man court danger and a woman shun pleasure? Oh, monstrous, what are conscience and honor? Why, honor is a public enemy, and conscience a domestic thief. And he that would secure his pleasure must pay tribute to one and go halves on the other. As for the honor that you have secured, for you have purchased a perpetual opportunity for pleasure. An opportunity for pleasure? Aye. Your husband. A husband is an opportunity for pleasure. So you have taken care of the honor, which is the least I can do to take care of conscience. And so you think we are free for one another? Yes, I think so. I love to speak my mind. Well, then I'll speak my mind. Now, as to this affair between you and me, here you make love to me, and while I'll admit that does not displease me, your person is well enough and your understanding not amiss. I have no great opinion of myself, yet I think I'm neither deformed nor a fool. But you have a villainous character. You are a liberty in speech as well as practice. Come, I know what you would say. You think it more dangerous to assume a conversation with me than to allow the last man the, 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 allow another man the last favor. You mistake. For the liberty I take in talking is purely affected for the service of your sex. He that first cries out, stop, thief, is he who often has taken the treasure. I am a juggler. That act by confederacy, and if you please, will put a trick upon the world. Aye, but you are such a universal juggler that I'm afraid you have a great many confederates. Faith, I'm sad. Oh, fine! I'll swear you're impudent. I'll swear you're handsome. Fish, you would say something, you do not think so. You do not think so, yet I should not tell you so. And now, I think we know one another pretty well. Good morning, Good night. Lovely work you 